Hey guys, how are you? Nice to see you again. I'm Eva and I'm personality and talent development psychologist. And uh, today I'm going to talk about the tools I use quite often. Uh, I'm going to talk about personality questionnaires and um, uh, you know the advantages and limits uh, they have. Um, because I use these tools really often uh, I know that there are some things people don't realize about them and some uh, you know some limits people uh, don't know about um, so uh, first advantages so the first advantage of uh, using a really good personality questionnaire is clarity you know, uh, if you go through a really good personality assessment, you can gain an amazing clarity, um, you know, regarding your personality, your operation style, you know, the way you're wired, uh, basically. Um, you know, it provides a, a look at yourself from a different angle. You know, that's uh, a huge added value. Um, it can provide a big, complex picture uh, in a very structured way. It's kind of like taking a photo of uh, your personality or your motivation or your values. Um, so you can actually look at it, uh, you know, someplace calm and quiet. Uh, so it provides a great opportunity to put all these pieces uh, you, to, together, you know, all these pieces that are, uh, you know, in your everyday life kind of, uh, um, you know, covered in, in fog. Um, so that's the first great advantage. The other one I want to talk about today is that personality questionnaires are great for self-development and growth because they can help you discover and explore uh, your strengths and also your development needs you know and to really um you know use this um possibility uh these tools offer it's really good to um you know work on it use it together with uh, a coach or with your mentor you know with someone who can help you uh, connect all the dots right so these are two great advantages uh, clarity and uh, self-development and personal growth but there are also some misconceptions or uh, you know limits of these questionnaires and um, you know I want you to pay really um, attention to them as well because uh, quite often they can do more harm than good. Uh, so what I'm talking about, you know, personality questionnaires, uh, you know, the ones that are used uh, in coaching or in counseling, uh, in, in mentoring, um, you know, they can't give you a diagnose, right? Or a label. You know, sometimes I meet people who are kind of looking forward to finding out that they are um you know kind of uh um uh, disabled in a way uh you know they are kind of uh looking forward to a psychology or personality assessment um because uh you know they have this expectation like okay so now you're gonna uh you know tell me that i'm i'm a sociopath or something these personality questionnaires don't work like that you know they provide clarity not uh a diagnose right there are some tools um that can do that but uh usually usually um you know you don't get in touch with these in in regular life right and the other limit that kind of you know is connected to the first one is that personality questionnaires or personality assessment doesn't provide or shouldn't 
provide uh, excuses, right? So um, if you're going for a personality assessment, uh, you know, with the outlook that, uh, you know, it's going to provide, you know, all the reasons why you are, you know, so weird in, 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 in the way uh, you think you are, then you have to change something about your mindset and about the way you approach yourself, um, right? Because the problem is there, it, it's, it's not uh, fundamentally um, somewhere uh, in you, right? So don't use the results as excuse, don't use them as an argument that you know that's why you can't get any better or that's why you can't grow and develop okay so um this is actually what i wanted to really quickly cover today if you're interested in a personality questionnaire the questionnaires then stay tuned because I'm preparing a webinar for you. Uh, we're going to use one of these and uh, I'm going to provide you, um, you know, some, uh, some guidelines how to work with that. So if you want to uh, get uh, on this webinar and uh, you know it right now, uh, just send me a message or comment uh, on this video and I'll put you on uh, the list, okay? Uh, also, uh, if you want to get on a free uh, strategy session uh, with me, uh, then comment or send me a message as well. Uh, I'll send you a link where you can book that call. Okay, so looking to forward to uh, see you again. Uh, have a great day and bye.